Nicholas is gonna be here any minute and I have to get the whole house ready. Hey mom. Hi Isabel. Do not tell me you have been riding the reindeer again without my permission. Um, may maybe? How many times, Isabella? A lot. Well, when your father comes home, he will not want to see his daughter running around on reindeers like a maniac without any control of it. Mom, they're reindeer. Sometimes they get out of the control. I've been trained for 12 years. I know how to control them. It was just this one time. Well, then how'd you get her? Because a good person, like your father, who rides around on Christmas Eve, knows how to control the reindeer, which is why he never crashes. Well, Mom, I was just thinking, you know, Dad was supposed to be home last week, and he's still not home, so I was thinking, if he didn't come home, maybe someone should take over his Christmas duties. And I was thinking that someone could be me, since, you know, I'm his daughter and all. Well, if your father does not come home in time for Christmas, which he won't, he will be home, I am going to be taking over as his job because I am older, much sure, responsible, and I know how to handle moving animals. But, Mom, I was thinking, you know, maybe, like, you're, maybe someone younger should do it, you know? I am 47. Okay, that's not old, and a 12-year-old should not be running around on controlless animals, especially if you crash and probably dislocated your shoulder again. Mom, my, sh my shoulder's probably fine. You know, like, it, it's happened before, but I think it's fine this time. It just hurts a little bit, like, when you touch it. You're going to go ice that right after... Why are you wearing those layers? It's 40 degrees out of here. Are you suicidal? Well, if it's 40 degrees out there, then you've come to the right place because we have three fireplaces going. Go on, get those off, and ice your shoulder after that. Fine. You'll never learn, Isabella. You need proper training. Okay. You can't just think you can do it without lessons from a real reindeer rider that already knows the secret location of the North Pole's clubhouse. Hey, my shoulder's better. It's better. Fine. Now, before you run off and do whatever your little things, we have a bit of an issue. Is this why you called me here? Yes. The elves are on strike. What? What do you mean the elves are on strike? The elves can't be on strike. Christmas is in five days. We don't have time for this, Mom. Yes, but the elves were very upset because they were not being paid enough candy canes. I mean, and five candy canes an hour because... is perfectly fine. And that's my problem because you have to get them back. You're the one who's supposed to be paying them, Mom. They already left for, like, Antarctica. I think Joey, like, met a penguin or something, and now they're like... Besties? It's disgusting. Okay. Oh. oh my god. What now? That's plane crash. What? Dad's plane crash. Look, it's on the news. Oh my goodness. It says Santa Claus found dad in a plane cra crash. Santa? What are we gonna do? Okay. <laughs> Now someone needs to take over for him permanently. Don't stop. I have well, You said he would be fine. Are you sure about that now? Well, can I predict the future? No, I am very magical in a lot of different ways, but I will not tolerate your behavior right now, which is exactly why I have a very special thing just in case this thing happens. <sighs> Aren't I supposed to be the one opening the present? No. This. What is that? It is a magical drop of hand sanitizer, or whatever you call it. It looks very normal on the outside, but secretly, it can grant the one wish that anyone has ever wanted. One drop. One drop. One drop. One drop. One drop. Okay. So this is exactly why. We could so use- are you going to use that on me? Am I going to be using them for the new Santa Claus? Because, I mean, you're probably going <laughs> to- you're probably not going to be around for another 40 years, let's be honest here. You, all you do is eat cookies and candy all day. 
You're gonna go on the stove for that. Mom! Anyway. It's the truth. This? Don't you want me to tell the truth? Aren't we trying to save Christmas here? We're going to be able to save Christmas by this one drop of hand sanitizer. You know what? Give that back to your mother right now. No. If anyone should be the one to do it, it should be me. Give that back. No. Give it. Try me. Isabella Scott. Give that back to me right now. Or else what? It could be dangerous. Because you're young and stupid and foolish. You know what? I'm it's worth risking it. I I'm worth risking it. You aren't. Okay. Take it. We'll see what happens. I'm gonna go gather the ring. Blake! Get over here! Run! Oh my god, what did I just do? Five years later. It was a bit You have once made a beautiful Christmas once again. Thank you, Mom. Now I'm going to go around the reindeer to visit Joey and his new penguin friend. Mom, Mom that's probably not a good idea. Mom, mom, I'll, if you need anything, I'll take you. You, you've gone, you, you have gone, I'm not gonna lie, you've gone pretty downhill in the past five years. Uh, you probably shouldn't be right, like, flying the reindeer. Well, I guess I'll go have more meat cookies, Lane. Yeah, yeah, that's probably a good idea. 